Well, that finishes the first playthrough. Now... Oh, the, moving along. I'm not I guess we're done. Sure. Ah, the monk. He seeks his master so he can become the master. If I'm going to play through two more times or not. It's a journey filled with peace and enlightenment. And murder. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure I'll play through one more time. Uh... Video Game Carnage has got his up, and he's, I know he's played through the Hillbilly, the Knight, and the uh, Twins. So I've got a couple of options. Uh, what I'm thinking about doing is seeing how much time it takes to play through it again to pick up the other pieces. It's just I, I don't normally play through it. <laughs> I'm not a big play through the game three times kind of guy. <laughs> And even though some of the load would be off, because uh, obviously if I did it, it would uh, just be their individual secrets. But there aren't... Uh, one of the reasons I went through this so quickly was because I wanted to get the uh, bulk of it out of the way before the uh, Don't Starve update, which is one of the biggest I've ever seen. And if you don't watch any of those videos it's probably the major item that I do and uh, that most of my viewers watch to tell you the truth and, and that is an issue and I'm very excited to do all those things in the new update so uh, on the endings that was actually I kind of got sidetracked so anyway I don't know how far I will go or, or uh, I, I think the odds of me playing through a third time to get one character's story are <laughs> incredibly slim, to what be completely honest. We're impatient, aren't we? Oh, uh, the adventurer. She okay, next on the now, list. Now, video game the did the would, hillbilly would slow the night. down. The scientist. She is on the cusp of a great discovery for all of humankind. And, and the there's other, you know, it depends on who you balance. like, and there's other uh, playthroughs out there. But I probably will see how much it takes to get it done. Uh, what else was I going to say about it? Oh, the endings. On the endings, you have to give back the fruits of your uh, ill... You have to give back your ill-gotten gains. Evidently, you have to give the guy at the gift shop back whatever it was you, you gained by your, your bad behavior. Oh, the adventurer. She is hot on the trail. Okay, next up. Hmm. The knight. He is on a quest for a sword of unequaled power and now, prestige. Now, the hillbilly is what interests find it me before the least. Anyone else I, gets hurt. Know, that's just my personal thing. But I probably will work at these as I have time. And like I said, the, the cave... These episodes came up very quickly because I really was focusing on almost them to the exclusion of every other project I do. Alright, so to get a good ending, well let's do this because it'll be noisy. Also, if I had a good memory, I could just burn through this because I would remember where everything is and all that and... With the narcotics, I don't. I don't want to look. Well, we can get one of his things out of the way and we won't have to listen to him anymore. Oh, 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 I hope you're not here to visit the cave because we, we, we're closed. The gruesome and horrific accident has occurred and there's no way we can open. No way. I shudder to even describe to you what has transpired. For the nightmares will forever haunt your every thought. Well, if you insist. When I came in, we had no trinkets to sell in the gift shop. <laughs> I do like the night. He's kind of funny. Alright, there's variations on the endings where you can give back an item, you can switch items between different members of the party and all that kind of stuff. But to me, uh, it's in the nature of those people to keep what they got. I mean, isn't that what the point of the story was? So, 
And, uh, what else on that? Oh, and evidently, for some reason, the adventure, and I don't remember who else, the adventure and somebody else get a good ending, even though they've done evil, and there was some comment on that, and I have no idea why that is, so. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and proceed at my own pace with these three, and we'll see where it takes us. Uh, like I said, a third, if, if it doesn't take a lot of time, I might do the, the hillbilly, but it seems a long way to the well to, to do the whole thing just for one character's uh, story. So anyway, thanks for uh, watching, and uh, I'll get back to it as I can. And uh, it, I, I can't see any uh, point in showing these people solving all the puzzles that have been solved already. Uh, one of the things that takes time with videos is some people have commented and noticed is the uh, editing time. But editing, rendering, all that kind of, and I do, I edit very heavily. And all that takes up a lot of time. So it's a lot quicker just to, to burn through to the, to move through to just put up the, the secrets information and just burn through the maps as best as I can and, and not worry about what I'm trying to you know what I'm trying to put up as far as regards to just things you've already seen there is a way I could reopen allowing you fine adventurers to partake in the unique experience that only the cave has to offer I just need three small trinkets to sell just three let me say that number again. Three. Take this giant novelty-sized key. This key is it? Open the employee's back entrance. I'm sure you'll find some treasures worthy of the cave's gift shop. little man isn't he I should probably fire him I think he's dipping into the till oh uh, there's something we never wanted to see looks like a crew of banditos Get off there. Now I should have had Frumpy Dump come up. Theoretical research. Oh, gracious, they all need names again, don't they? Uh, is as two axe handles wide a name? God, a scientist, female scientist, <laughs> Marie Curie. <laughs> if she'd actually lived to be old, she would have probably been fat and had a mustache, which is probably rude to say for somebody. That, well, it'd probably be rude to say even if they hadn't died in the name of science. So we have uh, Marie. I ought to be able to come up with a good name for a monk. They call him Bruce Lee. <laughs> well, we probably should have uh, left the... Uh, see, that's what I mean. I've got no clue about what all these were. Uh, it's a new day for me every day with the morphine. I do remember a need for a bucket. So why don't you get your ass down there and... I'm trying to remember what the hell we were... Oh, pick that up, you asshole. Just because you're a monk doesn't mean I have to be polite. Ah, I did remember. So get the bucket. Where the hell is the bucket? Well, go look at the knight's painting. Ah! Now, when Video Game Carnage saw this, he was a little bit... I. I don't know if you've seen, God, what is it? Is it First Night, that horrible, well, it's not horrible. I thought it was funny. The Heath Ledger thing where he's a knight and his uh, uh, 
Well, actually, he's a squire, and his knight has a heart attack. But it seems pretty obvious to me that the knight had a heart attack, and, and uh, the dung boy <laughs> and his pet turnip, turnip took over for him. Now, that may not be the case, but there's a, certainly a, an indication that the story might move in that direction. So the... I would suspect the knight is a fraud, is the, the root of that story. And I didn't really look at uh, at Marie's thing. We'll need a name for that. Boy, there's a... The problem with the knight is all the knights I know are good knights. Ha! Ha! You want to hear a... Uh, gosh, what is it? Is it a limerick? No, it's a poem. A, a lady offered a knight her honor. He honored her offer... And he was honor and offer all night. So anyway, that's my night joke. Oh, I see. So the game wants you to continue just theoretical research and nothing else, huh? So the game wants you to continue by making you think that that is a... Uh, okay. And there's my bucket. Well, pick up the bucket, Bruce. We may rename him. I'm not sure about Bruce Lee. There's some there's some other uh, monks that were like ninjas and all kinds of cool crap. I'm trying to think what I'm doing here. You are the master of the jump. Be the jump. Uh, I still think I need that crowbar again. Oh uh, well, it is what it is. At least I don't have the time traveler in that whole levitation thing this time. Oh shoot, what am I doing here? I hadn't exactly planned, I hadn't planned to go this far. Go ahead and get your soda. Monka Cola. Just suck that stuff down. Yeah, be kind to Mother Earth. I had just come in to uh, cut that little ending for the other series. <laughs> Bruce Lee in the hot dog quest. Try. Uh, let's see. I fear, I fear Marie because we might have to look up her dress again. Oh, he's carrying that damn postcard. Get rid of the postcard. We don't need that. That much I know. I think there was some cute thing that the gift shop guy said about stealing the postcard or some crap. There may have been something hilarious I missed. I don't know. Pick up the crowbar. I think we used it again, but I could be wrong. Alright, you're on claw patrol. And the monk's on hot dog patrol. And bell patrol. Oh shoot, I didn't bring up the damn <laughs> I didn't bring up the damn fuse. Well, Miss Frumpy Dump, I guess we'll be looking up your dress. I don't know, Frumpy Dump may work better for her. Certainly be an all-day job. <laughs> 